Hey guys, welcome back to some more Aberration, and we're here at the Drake area, well one of them anyway. We've got a little nest in front of us here, and there is a nice purple egg in it, and can you guess what freaking level this egg is? A one freaking 90. This is the max level, I'm gonna pick it up. I wanted to show you guys it though, okay. Let's uh, there should be at least a couple more drakes here now, because they move further down. Um, but I've grabbed a couple eggs so far. Oh hey, whoa. Okay, there's a lot more. Where are they all freaking coming from? Okay, die. All right, well, there's a lot of freaking drakes here, so this is this is not good. Um, <laughs> oh man, they just keep coming, don't they? Well, these things just respawn so quickly. Like, I've grabbed like four eggs before this, and look, barely, barely any time has went between then and now, and, and now we have this. Oh man, all right, die. One more to go. There we go. 190. That could have been the parent, and I didn't see the color. God damn it. I think it was, like, green. I don't know. Most of these things are green anyway, to be honest. Anyway, we are back. Um, I'm just down here. I often come down here and just try to find some high-level eggs. Um, we're just heading up around this area here. We haven't checked this side yet. Uh, hey, we got a nest right there. Oh, do we have one here? Uh, we do, but there's nothing in it. That's great. Let me see, do we have anything nice in here? We're just gonna pick up all the eggs that we find and deal with the drakes. What was that, level 50? Okay, I'm kind of running out of weight here, so we should probably... Can I carry any more? I can kind of. Let me drop that and put some onto my drake. So we have that 190, that is incredible. That's the max level for official rates and everything. Uh, somebody was saying before that you could get higher than that. I don't believe you can, um, but do let me know if for some reason you've gotten higher, and obviously don't tell me that you got higher if you're playing on some sort of modded version. For now, we're playing with the difficulty 5, so we have 190 being the max. Alright, there's a lot of freaking drakes here. What the hell? How many do I have attacking me right now? Alright, seems like a lot more. <laughs> I guess I've killed a bunch of them anyway. This one right here in front of me is like... Very, very tanky. Hi. There you go, buddy. Nice. Alright, well that was a 185. Let me see. Okay, there's, there's a high-level drake nearby. Do we have any nests over here with something in it, at least? We do have that nest back there, actually. Does it have anything in it now? Sometimes when drakes go over the empty nests, they don't... Okay. Sometimes they actually fill them, so it didn't seem to have done it there. Do we have anything else over here? No, there's just a bunch of empty nests here. Like, what is this crap? Is this one empty too? No, we got, a, we got an egg in here. Let me hop in. Okay. So yeah, oh hey, that was 185, nice. I, we just killed a 185 as well, nice. That could have been the mother or father or whatever. Is that one empty? I think so. Let's check down this area. There's a bunch more drakes up here. And they're all coming for me right now. Okay. Whoa, what the hell? I did not mean to jump. What am I don't mean to jump. I just want to fight. All right, there we go. <laughs> oh man. Alrighty. So I'm. I've got a 18 or 190 now. Uh, I want to hatch that today for sure. I do know at some point I want to try to get a 190 for the vanilla server as well. Or maybe, I don't know if we're eventually going to turn up the difficulty on this server to difficulty 6, meaning that there will be a new max level for Drakes. I don't know if we're doing that at any point, but if we don't, then I'll probably bring a 190 over to Vanilla. And uh, we'll test it out and just see if it's any good over on the island. Maybe we'll test one out on Ragnarok as well. Actually, to be honest, what I will do is, if I am doing that, I'm probably going to bring my Vanilla character on here and imprint on the egg or imprint on the baby um, on here with that character. That way that character would have it imprinted to him and not and not this version of Syntax on this server. Uh, we gotta get over there. There's another egg. What was that? We just picked up like a level 60, I think. Oh crap. All right, now we're in the nest. What level is this? 85, I think? I think it says 85. Oh man, look at all these freaking drakes. <laughs> they're, they're just coming out of the woodwork at this point. Like, they weren't here a minute ago when I rubbed that other egg. Look at this. This is crazy. Okay, I'm feeling like I'm not hitting these things here. The ones in the back. That's a very nice blue one. I'd love to have that blue. 
Alright, we're taking a lot of damage here. Alright, can we kill this one? There we go, he's dead. 95. Alright. So guys, don't forget to hit that like button if you find yourself enjoying this video at any point. I just thought I'd bring you through some more egg stealing here in case we got something else good, which we did. We got that 80, or the 185 even. Um, is there any more up this end? Don't think so. So you know what we might do? We might just head back. Is it this direction? Did I get turned around? It's definitely in this direction, right? I think it is. We might just head back and head out of here and just take that 190 and go, basically. Because uh, I'm pretty happy with that. We can even hatch that 185 if the 190 is no good. But I want to try and go for Drake's stats now. Like, I'm looking to try to get a Drake with really good stats. Now, you can't breed them, so it's just a matter of just keep just keep coming down here, I guess, and, and keep trying to find high levels and hatch those. And if they turn out good, keep them. If they don't, then scrap them, put them in the bin, whatever. Um, so... I'm looking to try to get them for the boss fight. I want to get a really good Drake for the boss fight because eventually when we're fighting the alpha version of, of uh, what's his name, Rockwell, that's going to be a very difficult fight. It really is. So I want to have the best possible Drake that I can have for that fight. So it's a matter of just trying to get a decent statted Drake and then obviously imprinting on that dude. Can we, you know what, I'll climb. I was thinking of trying to like jump and get onto that, but I'm not gonna risk it. I'm just gonna go for this one here. Okay, is this even gonna happen? There we go. <laughs> I, no, not here. <laughs> All right, well anyway, we're gonna climb our way out of here. It's gonna take a little bit to get back to base, but uh, yeah, I will see you there. Okay, are you guys ready? I'm ready, here we go. Level 190, Rock Drake. Hey! Oh wow! Oh my god, look at the colors! Oh, oh, it's like purple! Oh man! Okay, that weight seems pretty good. Oh dude, look at the colors on this thing. That is fantastic looking. God damn. What color is it underneath? It kind of looks like it's purpley as well. Now, is this actually purple or is it just look purple because of the purple crystals? Okay, uh, I can't tell what color that is underneath. Oh, okay, I see. It's a blue. That's like a blue underneath. That is very, very nice. You can see it better over here. So that's a blue underneath. Uh, it's got a, it's got like this weird purple color, which I'm really digging. Um, it's got orange feathers, and it's got like this green, um, I don't know, body color thing. To be honest, it's got like so many different body colors. It's, it's underbelly is blue. It's, um, it's main body, I, I, to be honest, this is more of like the scales and the spikes and stuff. So the scales and the spikes are all purple and then it's like, it's undercoat of just skin is just green and that looks amazing. Let me see. Wow, look at the face. Oh, dude, this is the coolest looking rock drake. I'm really happy with you. Look at you. Let me get you off of Wander there. Little buddy, what are you, male or female? You're a female. Okay, cool. Let me get it uh, on follow. Let's get it to come over here. I want to see it here a little bit. Come on. There you are. Look at you. So, so nice. I love those feathers as well, actually. It's a real contrast to the, um, to the purple and the green. And the feathers have blue tips. To be honest, I think most of these rock drakes just have the blue tipped feathers anyway. I did not mean to throw that. Um... Wow, that looks amazing though. I'm super happy with this. Holy crap. All right, so I do have some nameless venom in my fridge over there, so it's just a matter of imprinting this guy. Uh, it's gonna take around eight minutes for the first imprint. And um, yeah, I guess I'll see you guys then. I'm actually gonna pop these stats into the uh, into the dodo decks and just see if they're any good. So yeah, we'll, uh, we'll be back in a bit. Okay, so it says it wants to go on a walk, but I believe that that bug is still going, so I'm just going to hit E. There we go. <laughs> uh, so if you guys aren't familiar, I will just explain it for now. Um, this is a bug that is going on currently in Ark. It's probably going to be patched pretty soon, but if your Rock Drake asks for a walk, it doesn't really want a walk. And to get the proper thing that it wants, you need to either log out, or uh, I think if you go at a render distance, it should also fix it. 
technically it says it wants a walk, but it really wants a cuddle. So if you just hit E, it, you'll just cuddle it instead. Now, obviously, this will be patched eventually, so don't bet on this four or five months down the road. But, uh, yeah, so that is the first cuddle there. Oh, man. Ah, this is awesome. Oh, my God, these colors. I can't get over it. It's such an amazing-looking rock drake. Now, I have popped its stats into the Dodo decks. Uh, they have a stat calculator on there for every single creature. And it came up with... Da -da 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 -da, high melee and high weight, which is pretty good. I mean, like, high weight is handy, and high melee is very, very good. Now, obviously, high is not the top, I guess, result that you could get. You could get high or very high. And very high, obviously, would be a, a couple more points into this. So it would probably be close enough to, like, 300 or more. Um, so that's pretty good. I mean, the rest of the stats came out average, which is good. And I think it's... I think its movement speed came out very low, which is what you want, because movement speed doesn't get affected by those leveling points anyway, so that's completely fine. If it, if this was high, then that would just be a bunch of wasted points, because it doesn't change anything. Um, so yeah, we got high weight and high melee. Really awesome. So pretty good rake in, in general. I mean, like, I really want one that has, like, very high health or very high melee, but uh, we can keep trying. This is a good one for now, for sure. And seriously, it is a very nice color. So we're going to be raising this dude. And hopefully, yeah, we're going to be making this our main Drake, possibly. I don't know. I kind of feel like our Drake up there, Nathan Drake, might become our main egg-stealing Drake. You know, because <laughs> Nathan Drake is a, is a thief. We'd be stealing eggs. I'm really clever with my jokes. Um, so yeah, anyway, this Drake here might become maybe our killing drake so because he's got high melee we could go around and kill things with him possibly we'll see but anyway um we got some more imprinting to do here so i guess i'll see you guys back later when this thing is fully grown okay so our drake is fully grown here's the big reveal there we are amazing just absolutely amazing really really cool looking drake i'm so happy with the colors the purple is fantastic the green is really cool i love the feathers just oh man just everything it's it's just so great so let's head out over here by the way if you guys are wondering where the reaper is he's right here and i have yet to pick a name i gotta go ahead and, and choose a name it's kind of hard to pick a name for something like that because everybody just gives me like the same name it's oh uh, man we gotta come up with something really creative guys Let's, uh, I don't know where we're going. I guess we're going over here now. <laughs> Why was I not able to fly there for a minute? That was weird. Can I? Okay. That was, okay. Whatever. <laughs> I'm apparently incapable of flight or gliding or, or whatever. Anyway. What the hell? There we go. I like to do this, actually. Like, when you're doing this, like, pounce thing towards the surface, I like to actually let go like if you hit right click then you stop yourself from climbing and when you're doing that it stops you from flying up and latching it actually it's really cool for just getting around like watch this like we want to get up higher we could just do that and then we're up higher it's a cool way of like keeping yourself in flight but uh yeah i think i'm gonna head over towards where the um the reaper queens are so we gotta head back i need to head back from the way that we came I want to head in this direction. Stop. There we go. Give me something to jump at. Sweet. So yeah, um, let's head over here and try to level on some of these queens. They're a really good source of XP, seriously. And uh, they're really common as well. Like, you don't have to wait too long to be able to find one. Break up some of these. Kill all of the Seekers ever. Let's turn off the life for a sec. Oh, crap. Why do my emotes keep resetting? This is so dumb. Every single time I log into the server, like, the, the emotes just reset for some reason. Die already, dude. Come on. Oh my god. You know what? If we just do this... Now we can do it. <laughs> ah, stupid seeker. 135, no wonder you didn't die. God damn, get out of here. Stupid Karno. You're a high-level Karno, aren't you? Die. There we go, 95. Not that high, actually. And we got all this stuff on us. Look at this. We got like a little party going on. Nameless. We got some Megalosaurus. There's a rock drake behind me. All of the goodness and badness. Hey, Nameless. Get out of here. All right. So let's, uh, I'm actually not going to... Oh, my God. Wow. Apprentice Hatchet. Sweet. That's really handy. I like that. Thank you very much, Nameless. You know what, actually? Let's... Hmm, I kind of want to fight some Nameless to see if we can get something else. Let me turn the light off. See what happens. Let's 
stupid rock drake dead let's kill the spino while we while we wait die and spino dead where are the nameless is that them yes it is oh wow look at the levels already I'm gonna bring this up to 2k all right now let's do this all these nameless see if we get something cool we're just getting venom which is handy we could use that to heal uh, it heals me up by like a hundred which is really cool I'm actually gonna take all of that out and this too is there anything useful in here no I'm gonna drop all that and put this back in so yeah we got an apprentice hatchet is that much better it's not a whole lot better in terms of damage what about the durability 63 yeah much better much much better all right so let's head over to the Queens then get some XP going get our light back on oh wait no it was on I'm just like super dark all right something max level over here could easily be a rock drake because most rock drakes are usually over the level of 150 or 150 and that would mean that it will trigger that thing and say that there's a max level around here all right we gotta kill all these creatures stupid seekers get off me Seekers. Oh, holy crap. Did I just get Palavia'd? I didn't know Palavia can now hit me. Get. Why am I still Palavia'd? God damn it. Since when can the Palavia hit the, uh, you off your rock drake? Or could they always do that? Holy crap. That was dangerous. That was 150 secret, by the way. Is that new, or were they able to do that before? Because I, I don't think it, one's ever hit me off of a man before. That is so strange. Alright. There's nothing max level here as well, so we're okay. Man. I could have easily died there. Look at this. Wow, my boots are, like, dead. Let's swap those out. Let's swap out the pants as well, just for safety, but the rest should be okay. Stupid frickin' Pavlova! Get the hell out of here. Since when are you able to knock me off my mount? That is definitely new. Or is it? I don't know. Guys, let me know down below. <sighs> Alright, let's level that. Oh, I got two levels apparently. I think it only said one a second ago. I feel like it did. Can, everything's able to damage me on this uh, rock drake because Arthur Plura can break your armor if you're on a rock drake by spitting at you. I don't want to get hit by any of that gunk. Oh, that is a high level Arthur. I'm 40. Come on, buddy. Go down. Alright, let's go fight a queen. There's got to be at least one down here. I don't see any justified. There's a lot of spinos down here. A lot of everything, to be honest. Die. Do we have any queens? Yeah, we do. Sweet, we got one down there. Got some nameless coming as well to join the party. Just gonna be fun. We do have a plant species Z down there so we can heal. Did I get anything cool? I'll just take those, might as well. Take the oil. Hmm. Kill the seeker. There we go, we got him. Let's uh kill this rock drake and these nameless first. Okay, it's not coming for me yet. Alright, so what I'm gonna do is I have a couple levels, I'm gonna pump those into melee. And now we're gonna go fight the queen. We should get a decent amount of levels. That means we can level up our stamina. Uh, there's the queen. But uh, it's important to level up that melee so we can get this queen killed quicker. There it is. Oh wow, that's a lot of seekers. Oh, get off me. Stupid. Oh my god, that's a lot of seekers. There's like six of them right there. All right. Kill this stupid thing. Now the Seekers are coming back. It's like Queen or Seekers. Like, what do I fight right now? Let's turn off the light. 
got Nameless joined the party. Alright, Seekers are all dead. Light goes back on. Queen is gonna get killed. What level is this Queen? I feel like I should be watching the levels on these things. Level 10. Alright, because I didn't actually know when we were getting our Reaper. Oh my god, is there actually more Seekers here? I didn't know when we were getting a Reaper that it mattered what level the uh, the Queen was. Because when I originally was testing, um, I think I didn't realize that it was a level 1 that I was uh, fighting, the, the Queen, in the world that I tested in. Um, so I guess it just didn't, I guess I just didn't actually realize that the Queen's level mattered towards it, but uh, I realized it after, of course. <laughs> Unfortunately, that was too late, though. Come on, buddy. You are so tough. Do I have any levels? I do. Let's level some more melee and get this thing killed. Do you imagine if I got Pavlovid while trying to do this? That'd be the worst. Oh, no, I don't want to. Oh, please don't let that Arthropora come near me. All right, it's dead. Whew. Okay. How are we doing? We're doing okay. Let's actually just drop a couple of those just in case. Super handy. If I'm going in for the boss fight on a Rock Drake, I'm bringing a bunch of Nameless Venom with me. Because, I mean, if you go in and you have all that, you're being hurt, just drop a huge amount of Nameless Venom. Um, drop like 10 of them, you'll go by around 1,000 health or so. It's really, really great. Great way of staying in shape. Alright, come on, buddy. Come on, Queenie. You're almost dead, aren't you? You are taking so long to kill. You really are. Stubborn, Queen. Come on. Also, a lot of people have been telling me that, yes, you can get impregnated on the back of a mount. Well, I actually tested it for probably, I would say, um, maybe like a half an hour of just tanking damage from a queen at one stage, and I wasn't actually getting impregnated. I do know that there is a way to do it. If you hop off and hop on your drake really quick, the queen will think that you're like a player on the ground and it will trigger its animation of it will sniff and then it will, you know, swing around the tail. And if you're on your rock drake at that stage, it will grab you off. I do know that part, but um, it wasn't, I, I didn't actually know that you had to hop off or whatever and I didn't really want to risk that, so we just pulled out the shield and did it that way. But there's also a way of doing it where if you have two players, you get one of them to be on the ground with the shield and then he moves back when she triggers her animation and you on the rock strike move forward and then she you know she grabs you instead of that guy but you have to have like another player to do it that way let's kill him come on almost dead aren't you so yeah maybe we'll try it that way at some stage with uh somebody if, if anybody wants some help trying to get a queen but i'm gonna be very cautious of the levels of the queens that i'm killing in future I don't want to kill a high level. Definitely want to get impregnated by that. Alright, let's get out of here. No, I don't want to get caught in the acid cloud. Alright, I'm okay. Whew. Rightio. Uh, let's get back to that Z plant. Oh, well, we got six levels? Wow. Well, we didn't get a whole lot from that, actually. Did they decrease the amount of XP? They might have. Because it gave a lot more before. I guess that was only a level 10, but... Hmm... I don't know. Is that a shine horn? No, you're a featherlight. Okay, I thought that was a shine horn. Let's kill all these stupid nameless. Get out of here. Alright, let's head over to this thing. Maybe we can try and fight another queen. There's another one. No, no, that's a rock drake. This is definitely a great place to level, though. I mean. I didn't get a huge amount of uh, of XP from that, but I did get a decent, decent lot. Let me see, so... Bring that up to 2k. I'll leave it at that. And let me see about leveling some more health. Cool. Alright. I'm actually going to take some of this hide, because I need that. I'm going to take some of this. We're going to take all of this. And is there anything else good in here? Oh, hey, I'll take that. We can grind that up. I'm actually going to take these for flint. And that. And then we're going to drop all the rest. Yeah, let's fight these rock drakes. There's another one over there somewhere. It's not coming to us, though. 
Come on. Mr. Rock Drake, you're going down. Okay. How many queens on our butt? We gotta watch out for those uh, Pavlovas then. primitive hatchet from that also by the way when I say Pavlova that's like a joke <laughs> uh, I saw a comment the other day somebody was like syntax it's not called Pavlova it's a Pavlovia and then they 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 put a pronunciation kind of explanation or whatever I I I, I don't know if people realize but I am joking when I call them Pavlovas a Pavlova is like a cake that has like you know it has like Kind of a meringue. Oh crap! I, I don't want to get hit by those. Did that hit me? I'm not even sure. It has kind of like a meringue. I, I don't really know what else to call it. A meringue kind of base. It has like cream, and then it has like a fruit or something on the top. And I think there's some more stuff in it too. But that's 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 a pavlova. <laughs> They're delicious. Um, and it, it's a joke when I call the pavlovias pavlova. It, it's just a joke. I'm, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sure most people realize that, but like, I feel like sometimes not not everybody does. And that's okay, you know, it's okay if you don't realize these things, you know, it's all about learning, that's what life is about. But uh, yeah, no, it's, it's, it's a joke. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna poop or something? Yeah, alright. Uh, anyway, that's out of the way. Let me go ahead and just randomly feed food. Um, let's level some more melee. I'll leave that there. Whatever. I'm gonna take this though and that. Sweet. All right. What else have we got? Another rock drake. Where the hell are all the queens? You know, maybe I should go up to the surface. Ah, to be honest, like leveling is gonna be a lot easier if I do it down here, actually. Uh, for sure. Wait, we got a queen right there. Nice. All right, let's look out for some pavlova. Huh? Now we, we know it's a joke. <laughs> Alright, let's. Can I kill this stupid seeker? Seeker! There we go, you're dead. Alright. What level is this queen? Level. Does that say 10 again? I'm, uh, do I have to fight level 10 again? God damn it. Alright, well, we're gonna just try to fly right through this queen here and hopefully try to find another one after if we can. Alright, come on. Don't. Ouchie. That hurts. What else we got? Anything else over there? Seriously, gotta watch out for this Pavlova, because if there's if there's one back there and it hits me, I'm just dead instantly. Or else it's gonna impregnate me, which it can't because it doesn't have the glow or whatever, but that would be kind of funny. If I got knocked off by a Pavlova and, uh, and then, uh, <laughs> then the queen, like, grabbed me and impregnated me, that would be, like, the worst. Like, that's 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 not even funny because it would be like a level ten, so it's being impregnated with like a level ten embryo, which is just terrible. Oh my god, <laughs> it'd be kind of funny. To be honest. Whatever. All right, let's uh, let's hurry up and try to kill this thing. Do we have any levels? No, we don't. Gotta try to level some more melee after this. With this XP, we're gonna level melee only, and uh, hopefully try to make this thing a lot faster killing these queens. I know obviously my Megalosaurus would be able to plow through these things a lot quicker, but this is simply just for leveling. Uh, do we have anything else at all? We just have Spinos and Megalosaurus. Any Rock Drakes at all? Rock Drakes don't really give much XP, but we're fighting them a little bit. Alright. Come on, buddy. I love the way the feathers on the uh, Rock Drakes go up like that when, uh, when there's a Reaper nearby. I originally thought that the Rock Drakes were supposed to get some sort of buff from being around Reapers because they love killing them. Like, the Rock Drakes apparently hunt the Reapers, which is crazy to think. I mean, there's so many Rock Drakes, it does kind of make sense that they would team up and kill these Reapers, but... Um, I did actually believe before when they announced that the Reapers were the natural prey of the Rock Drake, I believe that the the Rock Drake would actually get some sort of like buff when it's around one and it kind of go into like an enraged mode of like, I need to kill this Reaper, you know, that's food. <laughs> Which would have been great. I kind of feel like they could still do that. We'll see. Because uh, fighting, fighting Queens is definitely going to be a lot easier on a Megalosaurus rather than a Rock Drake, so. 
I don't know. Come on. Come on, Queenie. You're almost dead. Just die already. She would just hop off and get impregnated just for the fun. Let me actually kill it on my character. No, actually, I don't want to do that. I want to get levels on this thing. Right. Ooh. Stupid acid. Don't want to get caught in that. Take this, this, this. These, this, this. Awesome. Okay, melee only. Lovely. Lots of levels. Let's cancel that animation and let's go fight. Oh, hey, we got a Pavlova right there. That doesn't work though, does it? Can you can't just shoot where they are, can you? All right, let's head over here. What? How did that not work? There we go. Come to me, Spino. Dead. Let's head up here. And by the way, if you're looking for coordinates, I did show this off a couple videos ago, but uh, we're in around this area. Got another... Is that a queen there? Yeah, it definitely is. Got some Arthurs everywhere, though. Don't want to fight these things. There's our queenie. Love lower you, sweetheart. 25? Everything's just terrible. Alright. Get our way through this queen, and then... Uh, and then hopefully we can find another one in time. Probably not, though. Hey, we got it! Nice! Oh man, let's get out of here. Oh, I've gained a lot of torpor. Alright, let me grab these and that and this and... Nothing else. Yeah, we're good. All right, another six levels, perfect. Okay, so definitely got some more XP from that being a higher level. Awesome, all right guys. Well, that's probably gonna be it for today. We're gonna do some more leveling on this thing between episodes, but I uh, definitely want this to be the main killing Drake at least. But we're not we're not gonna just abandon all of our other Drakes. You know, we have Nathan Drake. He's definitely gonna, we're gonna be using that one all the time as well for sure, but uh, I like to kind of have, you know, a couple, couple backups and everything. It's nice to always have a a decent amount of backups of your favorite team for sure so yeah um if you guys enjoyed this video go ahead and hit that like button if you guys want to see more like this you can of course subscribe what the hell is that spino doing let's uh no <laughs> it's about to say let's go find out but i mean we could it's pretty pretty self-explanatory he's just chilling anyway i think i said all the things so i will see you in the next one